Good morning from Toronto, Canada. I don't know if you can see behind me. Um, I'll show it to you now, but I have like the cutest Airbnb that has the best view of the CN Tower. So I just landed last night, so as usual, had the jet lag and was up at the crack of dawn this morning, which was a bonus because I got to see sunrise. Um, if you are new and you are just here, because I know some people just want to see a travel vlog, I'll put timestamps in the description box so you can just go ahead to each little section. And then for my usual fam, I shall have the chats with you. So I had mentioned in, I think it was my denim DIY video that I was coming to Toronto for a little holiday, um, so I'm here. So I got in last night, flew Aer Lingus direct, amazing. Um, I hate connecting flights, so if I can go direct, I'll do that. Um, so here is my Airbnb, I'll give you a little tour. Um, like it's not my kind of decor, but the view is amazing. So I've kind of wrecked it already. Um, so in there I just have like bathroom, but I've got a little kitchen. It's like a one bed condo. Um, I've got a bedroom in there, made my bed. But then the view, like last night I didn't even sleep with the curtains because the view was just amazing. So I am staying downtown. Um, so this is like my view. So you've got like the Rogers Center the aquarium, CN Tower, and then like I can walk to like the likes of the markets and stuff. So really good location. So I'm here for seven days. Um, I'm not gonna vlog every day, but when I do something, I will vlog. So today's my first day. I'm gonna meet with one of my friends and we are going to go to, I think I'm gonna do the CN Tower and the aquarium because you can buy it in a package. So if you buy it online in the package, it's cheaper and you can do the two. I also have a photography walk tonight. I don't know if you watch my Lisbon vlog. I went on like a photography walk. I love doing them in cities because you learn something new because you're with like a professional photographer and you can take just really nice photos to have then as memories. And um, so I'm doing that tonight. So that is Monday because tomorrow I have a big, big day. I'm up early and I'm off to Niagara for the day. I'm gonna go to a vineyard, I'm gonna go to Niagara, do the boat, get lunch, then I'm going to Niagara and the lake and I am so excited. Um, so my first proper day exploring, I'm literally just gonna go walk in, have to do the CN Tower, I mean, I can't come all the way and not do that. Um, so that is my plan for today and tomorrow. <clears throat> And then I go to the baseball on Wednesday and then I have a couple of days so I'll probably explore markets and things like that. So that's my rough kind of plan but as you'll see that could change. So first on my hit list, CN Tower. Let's go. Let's go up the top. It's kind of cloudy today. Um, it's to be sunny later so I might do the aquarium first and then CN Tower. So let's go.
should. I figured out how to open the balcony door. Oh, the view. Cannot tire of the view. So today, big day, off to Niagara. I booked a tour. It's a King Tours. Um, I'll pop a link below, if it's good now. I'll pop a link. Um, so I'm going to like a vineyard, Niagara. Then I have like two or three hours at Niagara Falls. And then I go to Niagara on the Lake, which looks absolutely adorable. I think we have like tea and maybe another vineyard and then we come home. So excited, my camera is all charged up. Last night I did a, so yesterday I done CN Tower and the aquarium, really good. We got like a duplicate ticket, I went with my pal. And so good. Then had a boozy lunch in a place called King something, really good. And <clears throat> then I went for a photography walk with Reese, who was amazing. I actually booked her too. Do you know when you book on Airbnb, a thing comes up and there's like things to do, like experiences. I booked it through Airbnb. She was so good. I'm gonna put her Instagram here because she was so like patient with me. Street photography is not my strength. I'll pop in some pictures here if you want to see the shots that I took. She taught me how to do like a long exposure shot and I was like thrilled with that. And um, so I'm really pleased with the pictures we took last week. And it was nice to walk around Toronto with the local. Um, she gave me so many places to go, like for food and things like that. So I was so grateful for that. So definitely a highlight. Um, I'll pop her Instagram here, um, but I booked her through Airbnb. So I am just waiting to be picked up. I have a bit of time before I'm picked up and I'm off on my day trip. So today is all about them um, beautiful, aren't they one of the seven wonders of the world? I think they are. Um, so yeah, Niagara Falls, let's go. So I am just finishing up in Niagara. I am just waiting on my bus to come and get me. I'm hiding under a tree to get some shade because it's unusually warm. So my bus tour is gonna bring me to Niagara on the lake now, which I'm so excited about because we're gonna go to a vineyard and I will not be spitting out any wine. I will be spoiling that wine. So Niagara Falls is amazing. What I didn't realize was there is like amusements and arcades just behind me. I wasn't expecting that. A little bit tacky, but good tacky, if that makes sense. I just wasn't expecting it. Um, so I chose not to do the horn blower or the maiden abyss, and I went behind the falls instead. I'm sorry, I don't know if you can hear me, just like helicopters. So I done the thing where you go behind the waterfall because I knew I could get some really good pictures there. Um, had I have gone on the horn blower, I probably would have ruined my camera. Um, so it's not as wet when you go behind the falls and you can get some really good photos. I'll pop one in here. Um, so yeah, off to Niagara on the Lake, which I'm so excited about because it's gonna be all the cutesy, like old world um, little buildings and loads of character and charm. So super excited. Mm -hmm.
checking in. Um, so I'm off to the baseball game tonight and if you saw my vlog from two weeks ago where I turned my skirt um, from a pair of jeans into a skirt. Um, I think I said it in that video that I was going to it. So here is my outfit all ready to go. So I've got my jersey on, my skirt that I made from a pair of jeans and then I'm just gonna wear with a pair of runners. So I'm super excited. The stadium is right next, I, I have like right next to my condo, deadly view. I know it was last night that they took open the screen. So it was really good. So I just had a ramble this morning. I actually had a bit of work to do. And then I went down to Sugar Beach, had lunch, walked up to the Lawrence Market, had a little walk through. And now I am going to the game. So I'm meeting my friend and we are going to have some pre-game drinks, as you do. Um, oh, actually last night I had pints after my visit to Niagara. Irish Embassy Bar, really cool um, and good Guinness, so just a little tip. I think someone recommended it on my Insta story, so thank you. Um, that was a good recommendation, good Guinness. So, I'm off to the game. I'm not going to bring my big camera to the game, but I might just pop in a few clips. Um, I want to just kind of relax and not bring my camera out to the game. But I will take some pictures like on my phone and stuff. I might even record on my phone a few clips. Um, but I'm so excited to go to the game. So, I'll fill you in after. I have the door pulled because it's actually quite warm and um, I've had really good weather this week in Toronto it's been so warm so nice so I don't think I took much or any footage of the baseball game I'll pop in some clips here and um, I'll have to look at my phone because I'm not sure and um, baseball game is absolutely amazing I had a hangover day yesterday I popped up to Allen Gardens just for a wander went down to the Eaton Centre and I did get to see the Sorry Girls. So they were doing a live recording of their podcast in the CF Eaton Center or something. There's basically a creative space there. Uh, they were recording a podcast and I seen it on their Instagram last week and I just signed up for a ticket. Um, but it turned out like you could just show up. And it was really good. I didn't get a picture with the girls because there was like a big queue, but it was just so nice to just see them in person and listen to their podcast and the whole centre is really cool. Um, I normally don't really visit like shopping malls when I'm away just because I'm not here to shop but it was actually a really cool shopping centre as well. Um, so today I'm going to go over to the islands. I'm going to get the ferry and go to Toronto Islands and get a bike, hopefully, if I can fit on one and cycle around and get a view. When I was in Niagara, I was talking to this lovely lady and she was like, the best view of the city and the tower is from the islands. So that's what I'm going to do today.
taking an adventure, my first time in Canada. Won't be my last, loved it. Can't believe my week flew in so quick. I'm gonna end my vlog now. Um, I am checking out my Airbnb and then I'm gonna go down to the distillery but I'm gonna pack up my camera just because I have my case and my backpack and stuff. So I have my flight bag packed for all my stuff for my flight. So I'm gonna end the vlog now. If I stumble across anything cute in distillery, I'll pop it into a blog post. Uh, when I do a travel vlog, I always put like a written, more detailed kind of blog post on the blog. And um, you can catch my other ones over there. Just click like travel in places. And also I have other travel vlogs. This ain't a first solo rodeo. <laughs> I've got like a playlist of travel vlogs and places I visited as well, if you wanna check that out as well. So I've got a brutal flight later on. I leave Canada at 6 p.m. I land in Dublin at 5 a.m. and I can't sleep on flights. Um, so that's gonna be a tough one. So there will be jet lag had tomorrow. Oh well. So if you made it to the end of this vlog and you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you are not already and I will catch you all in the next video. That's it. <laughs> Bye from my tower. <laughs>